And welcome to the resources for the assignment 3, full business plan for EVM 304 new business development. These three or four short videos on this section will outline the rules and regulation as they pertain to this particular assessment. It is important, like all assessments, that you are fully aware of what is required and what are the rules and regulations, because yes, it does have rules and regulations like all. And the first one is capital. How much money do you have to spend? Rumours abide, but the fact is, each of you in your pairs have £60,000 worth of interest-free capital to spend on the management or development of your business. So that's £120,000 total capital for investment over the period. Should you wish it, you can borrow a further 60000 between the pair of you, not each, between the pair of you, at commercial bank rates. This is normally repayable over five or maximum ten years. So the maximum amount of capital you'll have in any one year to start your business is 180000 If you're an individual, that's going to be 120000 60 individual, interest-free, 60 extra. OK, 120. Money is to be managed. Dougie will be holding lectures at the end of February in March looking at financial management and it is a very important part of your business plan. Most of you are post-placement will realise how important finance is to all sectors, events, hospitality, tourism and sport and you cannot do without it. So spend time and thinking about how you're going to spend and how you're going to manage your money. Those who are doing for not-for-profit organisations can obviously have the £60,000 per person plus the 60 from bank sections, but they're again obviously not-for-profit. You might want to look at other th funding streams such as the Natural Lottery or the Prince of Wales Business Forum or whatever is appropriate in your particular market. So rule number one, do not spend more than X amount depending upon your business. You will receive marks for prudent financial management, so things like leasing rather than buying, saving costs. However, there is another rule regarding your commitment to the business, which we'll outline later. So finances.